now we are discussing diastereotopic ligands so similar to the enantiotopic ligands we can explain we can give the uh, we, uh, explanation for the diastereotopic ligands so simply you have to replace again protons with another atom or a group of atom and see whether enantiomers are formed or diastereomers are formed so in this case diastereomers are formed and if diastereomers are formed after replacing that protons one by one then that protons are stereochemically non equivalent and stereochemically non equivalent protons if give diastereomers then it is called then they are called diastereotopic ligands now similarly uh, we can uh, explain here by considering uh, two examples so i have taken here this example and red colored protons we have to decide whether they are enantiotopic or diastereotopic so this is a proton and this is b when i replace a with another atom say z i get this molecule and when i replace this b with z i get this molecule now you can look at the structures of these two molecules these two are not mirror images so they are stereo isomers but they are not mirror images such stereo isomers are called diastereomers that means by replacing these two protons one by one we get diastereomers so that these two protons are stereochemically non equivalent protons and they are diastereotopic ligand so you have to just Uh, do this kind of exercise to decide whether the protons are diastereotopic or enantiotopic or homotopic similarly you can take the example of this alkene and we have to decide whether these two protons are equivalent or not stereochemically equivalent or not you can say this is a and this is b so when i replace a with another atom say z i get this structure and when i replace this b with another atom i get these structures these two are actually geometrical isomers these two are either z or e isomers they are geometrical isomers and geometrical isomers are diastereomers so these two protons are diastereotopic ligands and hence they are not stereochemically equivalent protons they are not stereochemically equivalent they are stereochemically different protons so these two are stereochemically different protons and they are called diastereotopic ligands thank you